everyone, so today is Monday, it's currently 10 to 9 and I'm actually editing the video that was meant to go up yesterday because everything went wrong yesterday, <laughs> I'll explain that in a minute but because everything went, went wrong yesterday I didn't get a chance to edit the video because I, I usually edit it on Sunday and then just upload it um, but I didn't get a chance to do that so it's going to go up today instead uh, so I'm, I've almost finished editing it, I just need to add the music but honestly that's my least favourite part <laughs> uh, because I hate trying to like sync up all of the songs so they go next to each other and doing the volumes and everything and I, I just hate it um, so I'm kind of procrastinating doing that by vlogging <laughs> um, yeah so I'm editing that and that'll go up at 7pm tonight instead of yesterday um, but yeah, yesterday. <laughs> Let's talk about yesterday. I was just gonna, like, not talk about it because I don't usually vlog on the weekend. Um, because I don't really do anything on the weekends because I, I just sort of prep for the next week and chill. Um, but I feel like I should probably talk about it because honestly, so many things went wrong. So, late last week, I think it, I think it was Friday, um, my Twitter account got blocked. Um, not blocked, like uh, temporarily deactivated um, because apparently I'm under 13 which I'm clearly not, I'm 16 so yeah, it, it was deactivated so I was like okay so I told my dad and we like sent proof of my age and everything um, but then I, I got an email back yesterday I think it was actually late Saturday but I didn't see it till yesterday morning um, asking, saying that they couldn't prove who I was but I sent them my birth certificate <laughs> so they knew exactly who I was but they, they wanted like a photo ID but because I live in England we don't have like government issued IDs here which a lot of other countries do I think in fact pretty much every other country does it's just here that we don't have them and also I wouldn't have one anyway because they're not issued in other countries until you're an adult and I'm not an adult so even if I lived in a country with government issued IDs I still wouldn't have one because I'm not an adult um, so, and then I don't have a driver's licence because I'm only 16 and you have to be 17 to drive in the UK and so the only other form of ID I have is my passport but you're not meant to give out your passport because then people can copy your ID um, like your passport is private, you know, your birth certificate is public but your passport is not so we were like, well, we don't really want to send them <laughs> my passport so, you know, my dad's been going backwards and forwards but in the end they did permanently deactivate it um, so I've lost my Twitter <laughs> because I think the account was technically made before I turned 13 um, like I, I honestly don't really remember when I first started all of my accounts but I don't think I was 13 because um, my dad sort of did it like prior to my 13th birthday as like a, a present kind of thing um, so, but because I wasn't 13 when the account was started, I'm now not allowed access to the account even though I'm over 13 now. But <sighs> I don't really care that it's been deactivated because I never really use it anyway. So I've just started a new account, I'm going to start from scratch. It's probably for the best anyway because, you know, I don't really want to be associated with the things I tweeted when I was 14. <laughs> um, also, honestly, it was just kind of a load of trash so I just started again but and then it just sort of everything went wrong and I couldn't make it properly on the phone and then the username I wanted was too long and then the one I wanted was taken and it was just a big hoo-ha and because of all this it put me in a really foul mood so I didn't end up um, getting anything done but yeah so that's why I'm editing the video today um, I'll leave a link to my new Twitter down below and I'm going to try and update as many like descriptions and things on my blog as possible so that people don't get confused because you won't be able to find my old account because it's been deactivated and may also be deleted uh, but honestly I don't care <laughs> so yeah Twitter has really annoyed me I was almost at the point of just like deleting Twitter entirely because I don't use it that much um, and honestly, like, they've faffed me around so much with, oh, we need this, and oh no, now we need this, and I'm like, well, I can't give that to you because I don't have one, and yeah, so I was almost going to just delete it, but 
I kept it, so yeah. But anyway, it's Monday now, start of a new week. That was last week, so I'm going to forget about it. Yeah, so if you remember from last week's vlog, I was meant to have a job interview on Monday afternoon, but it got moved. Um, so I actually have that job interview today. Um, so that's at 4pm. Uh, so I'll, I'll probably leave at like 3-ish, because it's just over the road, but I think I'll probably play Harry Potter on the way there. Um, so I want to leave a bit of leeway. So before I leave, I need to just finish off this video. And then I think while it's exporting, I need to go and shower. Because um, I also didn't end up doing that yesterday because I was in a foul mood. Um, and I should, you know, probably shower before my job interview. Um, also, my hair needs washing, which is why it's in a ponytail. So let's just ignore it. I also didn't end up finishing uh, reading Harry Potter yesterday, which I, I tried to. Like, I did read a bit in the evening. Um, but I just didn't end up finishing it because it got too late and I was tired. So I went to bed. Um, so I'm definitely going to finish that today, but I think I'll do that after the job interview because I prefer to read in the evening. Um, so yeah, I think I also really want to get some blog posts written because that was the original plan for today. But obviously that's been set back a bit by the fact that I had to edit the video. Um, but I'm still going to try and get as much of that done as possible. Yeah, so I really am kind of procrastinating now, so I'm just going to finish off this vlog, have a shower and then I'll check back in when I'm ready to do something. Hey everyone, so today's Tuesday. Uh, I didn't end up vlogging last night um, because I got back from my interview and it. I think it went really well. I'm really not sure if I'm gonna get the job because there was quite a lot of competition. I was definitely the youngest. Um, but either way, I actually really enjoyed the interview because it was a group one, there were lots of activities, and everyone was really nice. So I did quite enjoy it. But yeah, I, I did want to talk about the interview just very briefly because, um, you know, as I said in my first video, I wanted this channel to be sort of sharing my life and also my struggles as a person with autism and mental health issues. Um, so I actually, I got there, I was the first one there, but only by like a few seconds. Um, because like 30 seconds later there were loads more people. And I was not expecting there to be lots of people, like, at all. <laughs> I thought, because the first one I went to last week, there was only three of us. Um, but this one, I think there was 12 of us in total. Um, and they were all quite a lot older than me, most of them were like uni age. Um, and so I sat there and I was being very anxious and I nearly chickened out, I nearly just sort of left. Um, but I didn't and I'm really glad I didn't because even if I don't get the job, I did actually really enjoy it. It was quite a lot of fun um, and it was good, good experience. Uh, I didn't end up doing anything really after the interview yesterday. I had planned to uh, but we, went, we did a bit of shopping because we needed a few more things. Um, and then by the time I got home, it was already almost seven. Uh, so I didn't really have time to do much and I still needed to eat dinner so by that time it was getting quite late so I didn't really get a chance to read much. I did read one chapter a little bit earlier in the day but I didn't quite manage to finish the book. Um, I am hoping to this evening though. Yeah, anyway that brings me back to today. Um, as I said today is Tuesday um, and I'm going to my college welcome day today and I'm like 15% excited but like 85% nervous. Um, like I had a bit of a freak out last night because like, I didn't know what to wear, I really don't know how to make friends and I just, like I, I tend to not get on with people that well um, just because I am quite smart and I also, I have a lot of hobbies and interests and so I, I really struggle to find people that are sort of on the same level as me which I know can sound a little bit big headed but you know, I, I am intelligent, it's it's just sort of a fact, and I still to this day hate when people say, um, oh you're, you're really smart aren't you, because I never know what to say, <laughs> because I don't want to sound like an asshole, um, but you know, you can sort of just tell by the way I talk, and I also, I tend to seem a lot older than I am, and apparently some people seem to find me sort of intimidating um, because I sort of have so many hobbies and interests and I am very intelligent but 
I'm I really do want to make friends because I don't have that many to be honest um, the two I do have I love them very much but I would really like to find some friends you know in my new college because otherwise I'm not gonna have any when I go there but also some that share the same interests as me um, because you know my my current friends they they're not as into photography and art and things as I am and I really want to find some more people who are just as driven just as creative and you know love photography and art just as much as I do yeah it's currently five to seven uh, we're leaving at half seven which is quite early uh, it doesn't actually start until nine but we like I don't live in the same place as my college so I have to get there uh, my dad's driving me because he also works over there uh, I obviously won't be able to vlog um, the actual welcome day uh, both for privacy reasons and also because I don't think I'm allowed and you know because I want to enjoy it and actually make friends um, I also I don't have space in my bag to bring my camera um, and my other little camera is honestly terrible um, so I, I will have my phone um, but I noticed that when I used my phone before it didn't come out quite as good quality so I, I may or may not vlog and there also might not be that much interesting stuff to vlog um, but either way I'll update you when, when I get home um, so yeah that's kind of all the updates uh, sorry I didn't vlog last night but yeah I'm gonna go to my college welcome day now so I'll see you a bit later hey guys so today's Wednesday um, I'm not really feeling amazing today uh, I'm sorry I didn't update you last night after my welcome day but honestly I was feeling so drained and also really quite anxious I obviously had a job interview on Monday and then I also I spent the whole day out yesterday uh, in a new place meeting lots of new people um, there was a lot of information it's quite overwhelming and it, it's all just been quite a lot so I'm feeling really drained um, and also because I haven't really been in full-time education for a year and a half at this point so it was it's all just been quite full on so I was feeling really drained and really quite like foggy um, which is quite common for me and I think you'll see more of that as I go into college um, because you know while I'm on holiday I don't tend to go to lots of events or you know obviously I'm not going to school every day but so you'll you'll see that more in September but yeah I'm just feeling really drained and it, I'm still feeling really drained today um, but yeah, it, it's Wednesday so I have prom tonight, um, I am excited but I'm just, I'm still very tired, um, I also didn't sleep great last night, I don't know why, but I just didn't. Yeah, so I, I won't be able to really bring you to prom with me because I don't want to be lugging around a big camera, but I will have my phone so I'll, I'll maybe try and film a few things, but I don't know, like, because it'll probably be dark by that time, so like the... Um, the video probably won't be very good quality and it, it's never good quality on my phone so I'll try and film some things but I don't know if I'll be able to film anything um, but I, I will be taking photos um, so I might be able to like insert some photos from tonight yeah so as I said I, I did really enjoy yesterday and I'm, I'm really looking forward to going to college in September because I, I really do love photography and there's like so many opportunities there and like all the art departments interlink so like we can use like the props from the theatre department we can get fashion to make costumes we can get the makeup people to do makeup we can take photos for the fashion department you know we can get art to make backgrounds and stuff like that so like it's it's all going to be so cool and like I'll make loads of connections and I'll learn so much but it's just it was a lot and I don't do well meeting lots of new people in an environment I haven't really been in before but um, the staff there were really good I've been so so impressed with the support um, for people like me with additional needs um, I mean really my standards were zero uh, because my secondary school did nothing really to help me and every single thing we did get we had to fight tooth and nail for it and they'd argue at every every single step and 
it was just it was a nightmare to the point where we've pulled my sister out of school and my mum's homeschooling her instead. Uh, so, but I, I'm really impressed with the support that the college has, not just for people with additional needs, but just in general for you know other people's mental health. So I, I have been really impressed with that. Yeah, I'm I'm still feeling quite drained, um, and I obviously I want to enjoy tonight. So really, I'm going to do a whole lot of nothing today. I'm just, I'm going to hibernate for a bit, um, I think I'll probably read because I still haven't managed to finish um, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone because of, you know, the interview and Welcome Day and everything that's been going on, but I absolutely must finish that today. Um, yeah, so I think I'll probably just sit and read that and that's probably all I'll do today really because I, I really, I don't want to push it. So yeah, that's... All I'm going to be doing today, I'll film as much of it as I can, although I'm not sure there will be much to film because, as I said, I'm really not going to be doing much. Um, but le let me know if you want me to make like a full video about, you know, how I deal with, you know, my, my very limited energy resources and, you know, how I deal with like big events like that because I, I can definitely do that. I was thinking of doing it anyway. Because I think a lot of people don't understand that I, like, I can't do as many things as other people because I get burnt out and drained so quickly. So if you want me to do a full video on that, I can. Just tell me below. Um, yeah, that's it really. And I'll see you later. Like it's getting quite thin in the bottom bit, but I don't want to get rid of it. Like it's my spinny chair. Anyway, <laughs> it's Thursday today. Um, it's half past one, so it's a little bit later. Uh, I have filmed a few bits today already. Um, I had quite a late start because obviously I was out last night, as you saw, into prom. I had a great time. I was feeling a little bit anxious before I went, and like a little bit when I was there, but mostly it was just a lot of fun. Uh, it was really cool to like sort of see everyone for the last time even though I don't really know most of them. Um, it was just a bit weird because like that's probably the last time I'll see all of them realistically. Because <laughs> um, you know they'll move on, I'll move on and I'm never going to see them again. It's just a bit weird because like I grew up with a lot of these people. Some of them I've known since I was like three years old and now I'm never going to see them again. So it's a bit weird but it was a fun night. Um, I loved my dress and my hair and everything, um, great food as well, they had slushies and I love slushies so I was very happy about that. 
Um, there was a chocolate fountain as well, and oh my god, I love chocolate fountains. And honestly, the highlight of the evening was they had they had like pick and mix, but they had it in like a Ferris wheel. So each little tray, so like each cat, what was meant to be like a carriage on the Ferris wheel was a tray instead, and it had all sweets in, and you could turn it round, and each tray was a different sweet, and it was so cool. Um, that was my favourite bit. Um, but yeah, I had a really great time last night, uh, but I was quite out quite late, so. I don't think I was in bed until like midnight, um, so I had a bit of a late start this morning as you expect. Um, I say that, I was actually up at like 7, 7.30 which isn't that late, but it's late for me because I'm quite a morning person, I like to get up at like 6, um, which I know is a very controversial opinion, <laughs> no one agrees with me. but. Yeah, so today I I took all like, the footage off my camera from earlier this week um, and took all the photos off from last night as well. Uh, you saw me editing the photos a little bit before. Um, I need to send them over to my friend Zoe who I went with. Um, hi if you're watching. <laughs> I did also spend a lot of time this morning sort of just tidying up because as you can imagine I was really tired when I got home so I just sort of took everything out of my hair and just dumped it off my desk and then just went straight to bed. So my room was a tip this morning and honestly it still kind of is a tip especially because I'm going on holiday on Monday so I'm starting to like you know put things to the side that I need to bring with me so you know like putting clothes to the side so that I don't wear them and just little things that I need to remember to bring with me so I think today is going to be like a lot of sort of admin-y things so like I'm going to make a packing list so that I know exactly what I'm bringing so I can sort of put things away um, I'm going to just go through my bullet journal, plan, tick things off that need to be ticked off. Um, I should write a blog post today as well, because I, I did finish reading Harry Potter yesterday as well. Um, I think I did film that a little bit, so you should have seen that. Um, so I can now write my book to movie comparison, although that, it is quite a project, because um, there's a lot to go into and I want to do it properly, so I might write that tomorrow. It's meant to go up tomorrow, but it, my blog posts don't go up till 5pm, so... I should be fine to write that tomorrow instead. Um, but I might write like a shorter blog post and I might just do like a tag or something because I want to be prepared for the next couple of weeks so that I don't have to worry about writing any blog posts while I'm on holiday. Uh, I've also just been upstairs to talk to my sister to plan some photo shoots that we've got that I want to do over the next few weeks or next few months really because I've got so much summer holiday left. Like it's only, it's the 4th of June, no. It's not June, it's July. It's the 4th of July. I've actually got months left of my holiday. It's the 4th of July today. Um, and I don't go back to college until the 16th of September. So I actually have two and a half months, which is ridiculous because I've already been off for almost a month. So I've got a lot of holiday this year. Uh, but that's good because I've got a lot to do. I've got a lot of want to do. So, and you know, the more time off, the more time I have to work and things, so. Yeah, that's another thing I need to do. I need to like chase people to, you know, get replies back from the interviews I did uh, early this week and last week. Um, yeah, so lots of just admin -y, planning things, getting things sort of straightened in my head. Um, but mostly I'll just sort of be, you know, there's no rush to do any of it. So I'll just be watching some YouTube, listening to some music doing it throughout the day and then I'll write blog posts if I have time and obviously I'll read a bit later as well so yeah and I'll I'll film it <laughs> and I'll talk to you if I have anything else interesting to say today if not I'll see you tomorrow <laughs>
Uh, I didn't film that much when I got home after the summer fair yesterday because honestly I didn't do anything. Uh, I went there, I got a few things. Um, I got this necklace, which I love. Um, it's like, I think I think that's in focus. <laughs> do beauty guru here. Uh, it's like a little Marauder's Map uh, pocket watch. So it does open and it's really cool, I just love it. <laughs> um, and I also got this ring. Yeah, the summer fair was cool. I wasn't there for that long. Got a slushy, bought some cool jewellery, and then I went home. Um, it used to be more fun when I was a kid, but I'm a bit old to go on the bouncy castles now. Uh, actually, most of them too big. <laughs> they won't let me go on them anymore. So yeah, I went to that, and then uh, mostly just watched YouTube. <laughs> um, so yeah, today is Friday. Uh, I have to write a blog post today to go up tonight. I'm um, writing my Harry Potter book to movie comparison for uh, Philosopher's Stone because I finished that on Wednesday, I think. Um, so I need to write that. Um, yeah, so I think honestly that will probably take me most of the day because um, it's quite a big blog post to write. There's a, lot, there's a lot that needs to go into it. Book reviews and things do tend to take me quite a while. Uh, and I also need to take some photos for that as well. Um, and yeah, I think it's just going to be a bit of a slow process today because I'm not feeling great because I'm on my period. Um, and I was kind of, you know, not sure whether I was going to tell you that, but, you know, it's a normal part of life. Um, it happens. It sucks. Uh, being a girl sucks. Um, yeah, I don't feel great. In fact, I'm in kind of a lot of pain. But, you know, you just got to keep going. So, yeah. <laughs> Um, I'm going to write blog post. Um, I think I'm going to take the photos first actually and then I'll write the blog post a little bit later um, and then I'll probably just read for the rest of the day. <laughs> uh, I don't really have that much planned. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go take some photos and I'll check in with you after that. So I just finished writing my blog post, um, as predicted it took me a hell of a long time, it's now 2 o'clock, um, I think I started at like 11, so it took me a long time, but it's all done now, it's scheduled, it's going to go up at 5, so that's cool. Um, that's kind of the only thing I absolutely had to do today, um, and I'm feeling quite drained after that because, you know, it, it's a lot, <laughs> it's a lot to write a book review, and this is like book to movie comparison, so it was quite a lot, uh, I was really like analysing it, so... I think I'm just gonna, well I think I'm actually gonna have lunch first because I'm hungry um, and then I'm just gonna chill, watch some YouTube for a bit um, and then I think I might do some research for some photo shoots I want to do uh, I want to find like inspiration images and sort of just plan out what I want to do so yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do now yeah, and I'm also gonna charge my camera battery because it's about to die so I'll see you in a bit <laughs> Hey guys, so it's 20 to 8 now, so quite a bit later. Um, honestly, I'm not feeling great at all. Um, you know, on my period, <laughs> all the girls know it. But yeah, I just, I really struggle when I'm on my period. And I think I might do a whole video about this because I know it's, it's a bit of a taboo subject, but it really shouldn't be because, you know, it's a normal part of life. <laughs> Pretty much, you know, most women menstruate. Um, it happens, it sucks, <laughs> it's the worst part about being a girl quite frankly, um, yeah, but, so I'm really not feeling 100% at all, but, you know, I'm just sort of, you know, I, I, like, I don't have much to do today, like, I didn't, I mean, I don't have anything I have to do at all really, um, but, you know, I, I wanted to write quite a few blog posts because I want to you know have lots backed up like I used to rather than just writing them sort of on the day they're meant to go up I prefer to have them backlogged um, but you know I've written one and the book to movie comparison did take a long time it took like three or four hours um, so you know I, I have done a lot today uh, and I've looked for some inspiration photos as well for the photo shoots I want to do um, I took photos for the blog post too, so like I have done quite a bit today. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm currently planning a different blog post, it's just a tag so it's quite simple. Um, I actually, I planned it on like seven different post-it notes, like I don't know why, 
um because like my laptop's right here i could have just typed it up but i chose to write it on post-it notes instead but don't judge me <laughs> um yeah so i've just been sort of panning that i think i'll just sort of type it in note form and then i'll you know write it properly tomorrow i think yeah so i just i think i'm just gonna type this up and then i think i'm gonna read because i am in quite a reading mood actually I'm actually in like not much of a Harry Potter mood because like don't get me wrong I love Harry Potter um, and I do obviously <laughs> want to keep reading it because love it um, but like it's the first time this year at all really that I've really felt the urge to pick up like a new book or new, a new fantasy I really want to read a new fantasy um, but I think I'm just gonna I'm gonna keep out this Harry Potter thing um, because I, I, you know, it's not often that I get the urge to start any fantasies and I don't want to, um, you know, sort of start one just on a whim and then, you know, get bored of it very quickly because I lose the motivation. I also, I really want to do this Harry Potter book to movie comparison thing because, and I really want to get it done before I go to college in September because, um, you know, I've been planning it for over a year at this point and I just, I really want to do it. So I'm going to read some more Harry Potter um, and then I'll go to bed really because I do go to bed quite early um yeah and I think I I was kind of uh, when I first started this I wasn't going to vlog on weekends at all um just to give myself a break but I am actually like I really enjoy vlogging uh it makes me do more as well because it's like you know it's not that fun if I just tell the vlog that you know the only thing I've done this week is get up sit in my desk chair <laughs> play sims have food and go back to bed and then do it all over again so it motivates me to do more things and I do I do enjoy vlogging so I think I still won't vlog Sundays because I don't do anything on Sundays apart from edit the video um, but I think I will edit tomorrow uh, edit I think I will film tomorrow um, because I am doing some cool things tomorrow uh, my mum's going to get her nails painted at the city uh, and I always come with her just just because, really, because I can, um, and it gives me the chance to just sort of get out the house, so I'll go with her. Um, it usually takes like just over half an hour for her to get her nails done, um, and that's not including the time it takes to walk from like one end of the city to the other. So I usually, like, we drive there together, and then I'll go and sit in Starbucks and she'll go get her nails done. So I usually have like about an hour um, by the time you factored in walking backwards and forwards and waiting for the appointment and things, so. I'll probably go and sit in the Starbucks and write. Uh, I might write blog posts, or I might uh, work on some of my personal writing. Um, I haven't really talked about that much in the vlogs yet, but I think I might start doing like writing updates as well, but I don't think not quite yet because I'm not really, like I don't really know where I'm going with my writing. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll talk about that in another video because I think this vlog is already gonna be quite long because I did quite a lot this week. Um, but yeah, so I will vlog tomorrow, um, yeah, so I'm not going to be doing anything else this evening really, um, so I'll just see you tomorrow I guess. Okay, so today is Saturday, uh, you saw me making some mood boards for some photo shoots earlier and honestly that's all I've done today. Um, I woke up quite early, I also woke up quite a lot during the night because it's that time of the month and I never ever sleep well. Um, so yeah, um, I got up, played some sims because I was just, <laughs> I needed to do something but I couldn't focus on anything so I just played a bit of mindless sims um had some breakfast uh wasn't very exciting <laughs> um just had a pasta bake which i know isn't like breakfast food but i i just eat what i want at whatever time of the day i don't really care about what is like breakfast and what is lunch you know um which my friend zoe strongly disagrees with um 
yeah and then I found some photos on Pinterest and I was just looking for inspiration for the photo shoots I want to do because I'm thinking of doing a few photo shoots next week because um, I'm on holiday next week and I'll tell you a little bit more about that in a minute um, yeah so I did that and then honestly I had a nap <laughs> um, I didn't intend to uh, I was just feeling really crappy so I lay down uh, and then the next thing my mum was knocking on the door <laughs> and she woke me up so yeah um, she's done my hair now because I'm still not feeling great but um, she's going out to the city to get her nails done before we go on holiday on Monday um, and I always come with her so usually I'd sort of walk off and do my own thing but I'm feeling a bit delicate today um, sometimes I do you know when I'm not feeling great I just sort of feel less able to cope with the world my anxiety is higher um, and I just I become a lot less independent so I'm just gonna stay with her instead while she has her nails done um, I'll probably just I think I'm I was gonna write um, but I need Wi-Fi to do that um, and the place she gets her nails done doesn't have Wi-Fi so I think I'm gonna uh, sit and plan out some videos instead in my notebook because um, I want to do some more like more sit down videos instead of just vlogs um, so I think I'm going to plan some of those because I've got lots of ideas but I just don't know which ones to do first and you know when I'm going to film them so I think I'm going to plan that um, and then we've got lots of things to get while we're at the city for the holiday next week and you know I'll probably pop into Waterstones as well because I can't not when I'm in the city yeah so that's the plan it's currently half past 12 uh, we're leaving at 1 because her appointment's at 1.30 yeah and so regarding the holiday next week uh, I'm going away from Monday to Monday so I'll be the way for, from the 8th to the 15th of July um, I won't be vlogging it because I do just want to sort of you know switch off and enjoy my family holiday however I will be filming some other videos while I'm there so there won't be a vlog going up next Sunday um, in fact I don't think there'll be a video up next Sun like next week at all because I can't edit on my laptop because I use Premiere Pro um, and it's the worst so software ever um, don't recommend I love Adobe's other stuff but Premiere Pro is terrible <laughs> uh, but I don't have a Mac so I can't use like Final Cut Pro and all the other things so and also we already have Adobe so you know there's no point buying something else but it, it's terrible <laughs> it just doesn't work very well it crashes all the time and it absolutely doesn't work on my laptop so I won't be able to edit while I'm away um, but there will be lots of new videos when I come back and I will be filming some other little things including maybe a behind the scenes video of like a photo shoot um, and some other things but I won't spoil the surprise <laughs> um, so you know subscribe if you want to see that um, and also if you follow me on my Instagram um, uh, at the photography dragon um, I post more like daily updates there so you'll get more idea of what I'm doing um, and I'll, I'll still be posting to my story and things so if you want to know what I'm doing like day to day then I'm st I'll still be on over there assuming I have Wi-Fi of course which I may not um, yeah so I'm going away on Monday it's currently Saturday so today we're just going to get some last things um, tomorrow will be sort of like prep day um, so you know shower shave wash my hair paint my nails um, I'm not sure like because I still have um, my nail polish on from prom and it's still fine so I think I'm just gonna leave it on but I don't know whether to paint my toenails matching or not because like, I can never really paint my toenails because honestly it's just a bit annoying because you know I live in England so we don't really have like sandal weather that often but you know it, it is quite warm here at the moment which I honestly kind of hate because <laughs> I don't like the hot weather particularly um, but I, th I think I probably will paint my toenails tomorrow and I'll think I'll watch Harry Potter while I'm doing it um, yeah so that's the plan for today going out in like 20 minutes and I'll bring you with me <laughs> and yeah I'll update you when I get home Hey guys, 
guys, so I'm back from shopping now. Um, it's five past six. Um, I'm really not feeling great. Um, I, I hate being on my period so much. Um, this won't be like a monthly thing, uh, which I'm sure confuses you because surely, you know, most people it is a monthly thing. Um, but I run, I'm on uh, birth control um, because my periods, they ruin my life basically. I just can't cope with them. Um, it really affects my mental health, you know, I, you know, take one step forward and ten steps back and so I'm on the pill and I sort of, I run the packs together. Um, so I, I only have a period like, like twice a year really when I have to because you can't just do it indefinitely, unfortunately. Yeah, I'm sort of doing it now in between because <laughs> early this week was very busy and then I wanted to get it out of the way before I went on holiday next week. So yeah, um, I'm feeling really crappy. <laughs> Um, but my mum's going to make me some porridge, um, I've got my cookies, um, and I think I'm just going to sit and I'm going to watch Harry Potter. Um, yeah, I, I did write a blog post when I got home, um, it was just a tag so it's quite a simple one. Um, I've made a list of what I need to do tomorrow because there's quite a lot I need to get done tomorrow and on Monday morning before I leave to go on holiday. Um, so I don't usually vlog on Sundays anyway but I definitely won't be vlogging because I just don't have the time, I need to just, you know, get it done. Yeah, so I think for the rest of the night I'm going to watch Harry Potter, I'm going to make notes on it um, in preparation for my second book versus movie uh, blog post uh, for the Chamber of Secrets. Um, I think I'm going to paint my toenails as well to match my nails because my nails are still painted from prom and I think I'm just going to paint my toenails to match. Um, yeah, and then I'll probably read a bit before bed and then I'll get some sleep. So yeah, I'm going to end this video here, um, thank you for watching, like, subscribe, you know, leave a comment, all those things, and I will see you, probably not next week because I'm not vlogging, but I, I'll see you the week after. <laughs>